Man, I had cheats for this too. Both are still active. Yes, they are. Okay, cool. Well, we're on the third and final planet anyway. Oh, thanks. A great start to that area. What the fuck? I just got punched again. Oh, I know what it was. It was this thing over here. Something that's just scrambling my sensors. What about that thing? No, oh, no, uh, that's me. I use the end. Uh, Still quite a bit left to this game at least. Because I expect this world to be quite long. Back up yet. Cool. I might need this. Nope. Yep. Maybe there's so many buttons you have to press. Just to cycle through things. No! Do it all again! Fucking shit, man. It's like they went out of their way to try to make this part miserable. There it is. Phew. Hopefully the third planet isn't too big. I don't know lately they all have. I know, right? They had to save money somehow. Oh. 
in the gun game. And by game, I mean me. I guess I'll take accountability for my actions in this game. For once. Let me guess, I need the umbrella. Oh yeah, I do. Whoop. Oh, I had to use invincibility just to ex exit the level. Wow, that's paranoid of me. Oh, they brought back this music, too. This doesn't look like home to me. What does Bob's home really look like? I guess you might see it during the intro and not much else. Oh, you can stand on that, okay. Hold on. What the fuck do you do here? You climb up the trees? Damn. I think so. in this level. Looks pretty weird, but then again, so is the rest of this game. For better or for worse. Is this the way I gotta go? Ow! The one that we grab it! coming from? I think it just kept materializing. Where's the exit? How the hell do I get over there? Uh-oh. I think I need to keep springing. Or not. What the hell? I'm... kinda confused. Let 
try to get as up as I can. I think I can go this way. I do not like being accosted like this. Okay, I think this is the way out. I've gotten high enough... ...in the game. Huh? It's over that way? I want to be out of here, too. Next password. Cool. Oh, this music again. This place is creepy. Going in anyway. You'll have to learn to like it. People that know how to manage, like, using all these items and these remotes could definitely speedrun this game real quick if they knew the most optimal setup. Probably skip, like, maybe a percentage of the stage. Fuck off! I, I died anyway! This is why you need invincibility! He runs into like so many suicide bullets, it's not fit. Am I dying when I'm cheating? Because there's no invincibility cheat. I checked. Like, they give you cheats for unlimited ammo and lives, and like make time tick slower, but not for health. Bob code is way too powerful for Game Genie. Sorry. Oh, 
Mushrooms. Is this the only way I can go? I think so. Why do these one of these enemies look like something out of Balls 3D? Like that red creature. Look at that. Casual nuke bomb. No biggie. I think we normalized uh, weapons grade nuclear energy, right? I think we've gotten to that point. Like, it's bad enough that there's, like, a constant supply of gray balls coming at me. It's another thing that they've consistently found a way to stick to my hitbox. Like, so consistently, too. Yeah, I see where the exit is. Oh, Christ. That's two straight levels. I was close to death. Because the enemy placement is just obscene. Wonderful! This is weird. Wait, is this a boss level? Yes. It's Red Skull! Now Green Skull. And now Purple Skull. And now Blue Skull. Another Red Skull. Falling faster. What a weird boss. That's how I feel about this game as a whole. I'm disappointed in it. Time for a ride! Like, it could have been so much better had there actually been less of it. And I know that sounds like a weird thing to say, but it's true! Like, levels feel very long, even though they're only a couple minutes. So they're short and long simultaneously, if you can believe that. And on top of that, there's just so many of them! <laughs> At least with Super Mario World, which, which also had a lot of levels, they felt fresh. And they offered at least some challenge you need to think of. Or like how the level's gonna be approached. Here, it's just, here's a bunch of rooms, kill all the enemies where they kill you, find the exit. Oh, by the way, there are deadly traps. Now do it again. And again. And again. 
Oh, and maybe one more time. No, well, just kidding, maybe 30 more times. Like, every level just feels like it has the same kind of objective. Like, you might change things here and there aesthetically, but the end goal just feels the exact same every single time. Like, maybe except for, like, the driving sequences, but there's so few in between. Wait, 62 levels? Why did this- Why did a game like this need 62 levels? Like, if you have let half that many levels, you could have spent that time to make them better. But instead, you're focused on quantity, and now a lot of them just feel the same. I'm pretty sure this is not even the way to the end of the stage. Oh, see? I'm pretty sure I'm not supposed to have, like, this helicopter. I'm use it anyway. The fuck video game. Okay. I feel like we're getting somewhere with this, so not there. Not. Or there. Or there. That's it. Levels where the hazards just find a way to home in on you and they infinitely respawn from above you is terrible. Good platformer normally has a point A to point B, no A to point. Get lost in Q, must go back to D, make a left turn at M. Make a hop, skip, and jump from P, go past B, and end up T, and you're gonna suffer, and you're just playing, and then you're several steps from B. I feel like you described the map system of Mega Man ZX. Like, it was just a convoluted mess, too, but it was still a much better game. Stop item. That's cool. What? It doesn't even you stay in hit stun the whole time when you're on that? Oh, 
Okay, at least you can- Oh my god, you can activate it in midair. You can't even duck through that! Alright, I got a plan. This might work. There we go. Why did I even need to do that? Feels like it's a lot going on there. Can't you walk under those? What, you mean the flying things? I tried! And it still launched me up! I'm like, why? My head's under it! What does make sense in this game? Yeah, if he, if he didn't write down the password, I guess it was for the best. You being a lonely male robot trying to get laid, that makes sense to developers? I feel like, the, by the end result, that they were only projecting. And they had to use this game as an output for release. How long is this game? Fuck if I know, I never finished it. All I know is that we're here until it's done. when you was younger? Yeah, when you were younger? When we were kids, we had way more patience back then. And we learned to appreciate the games we had because uh, we probably weren't going to get another one until holiday. Like now, uh, we just don't have as much time to put into a single game and learn it. Especially since we now are spoiled with so many more gaming options than we were back then. But nowadays, when you find a game that's just utter shit, like, okay, we'll just play the next one. You were good. Like you didn't have to worry about the one game that sucked. Because you had like a few like dozen that were probably better. Looks 
like they were all bad. That one enemy nearly rinsed all my health in seconds. Like, that's gotta be infuriating, getting, like, deep into a level and then dying to a single enemy. Ah, oh, shooting, eh? The shooting is fine, everything else isn't. Looks like there's more after this level, too. <laughs> Playing Bob is just the equivalent of Billy Mays being in your ear all the time, screaming, But wait! There's more! And does it for probably a couple hours. More than that, if you're just awful like I am. Try the light bulb. Oh wow, still managed to get a cheap shot on me. Go fuck yourself, enemy. At least the levels are not gonna have you walk a path for two minutes and you find out it's a dead end. But they'll always lead you somewhere important, eventually. So it has that going for it. But not much else! Actually, let's use it. I'm not even sure if this is the right way. Again. Huh? Now there are bubbles to use? Okay, that's different. Equivalents of two kids looking at the same scenery, asking their father, every minute are we there yet? And most of all, asking their mother only to get the response, ask your father. I mean, uh, yeah, that, that's uh, that's pretty accurate. I don't know what I think about it.
Something bad is going to happen. Wow, you're only noticing this now? You're a bit late to the party, Bob. Oh, it's feels above from Symphony of the Night. How you doing? You changed. Don't you love bosses with more than one phase? We do it a lot, I know. Levels are there. You would think a boss that big would tell you where I'm the main leader of all these creatures. And then you find out, no, it wasn't. What the everlasting fuck? How much more can you do? worry about hazards like this too. If only he just armed this with a gun. We're taking out the uh, roto discs right there. That there. Wait, for what practical use would you design an alleyway like this that leads nowhere? From a practical point of view, why does this exist? And why is that to make this noise like every time, like just shaking something in a bucket? Like, for the entire freaking level. This is an assault on the ears. You're a silly little rabbit. I mean, I have to be. I mean, how else do you climb up the Twitch algorithm nowadays? I'm playing Fortnite. <laughs> That game is not for me. Played it once. That's all I ever need to play of it ever again. Circle, yeah, it is a circle. Oh shit. I don't even need to be here. Wait, huh? Does this also lead up? No, this is a different area. Um Oh, I'm not going backwards. Recognize some of this. Oh my god, it's all gone wrong. No, everything looks the same. I feel like maybe 
this will help me. I hope. But now I'm getting a little pessimistic. Oh! Oh, sweet Jesus, I found it. The worst part about entering the next level is that you know there's another level after that, too. And it almost looks like there could be a road behind that. It shows you there's several more levels. Also, this one's seven minutes. That means I should have a sensible amount of time, right? Feels like enemy gauntlet after enemy gauntlet. The good news is it does feel like there's only one place to go. And they seem to give you health more, more frequently. Drop you there. It's guaranteed damage you'll be taking. I need to go. <laughs> and just hope for the best when I go there. Maybe I should stop using the ball. That's got that's really hard on the eyes. There's speedrun strat, let's go. Oh yeah, I forgot there was like a, a maze level in Empire Strikes Back. I almost felt like there was like more than one. And nearly all of them you had to play as Han. Oh, okay, well at least that level's over with. There's no other- oh wait, there is a road. I, s I thought that was just a divot and the, uh, planet. My hopes were rising. And now they're dash. Oh, eight minutes?! They're gonna put in a level that might be longer? Yo, I'm starting to think the uh, gamer might be exhausted from playing such a super long level. 
Let's do a super duper long level. That'll make the, the person feel better. No, it won't. I'll tell you that much. Clearly the devs of this game are more out of touch than the Platinum CEO. You know, Babylon's Fall kind of did bad. Uh, people were complaining about the uh, live service kind of feature we wanted for it. No, we're not going to stop doing it. I think it'll be successful this time. So we might do it again. Because basically what resulted from that is a triple-A title they got hyped so much and then they, uh, they're gonna cut off the servers in, what, a year of it coming out? Over a year? So people can't even play it offline either? What a disaster. It's been delisted from Steam before the servers got disconnected? Wow. What a mess. What game is this? Babylon's Fall. I don't know if you heard of it. Game? Stop launching me into there. The ladder! Okay, or not. You didn't have to. We're gonna just accept being close to death. I know, it's totally okay. No. 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 Oh my god, and free damage that you're forced to take because an enemy just happened to be right there? What the f- Oh! It wants you to use the invincibility drone while you're in that state. Who would think to do that? Ass! Yes, that idea is ass. And only the worst kind of ass. I wonder if the people, the team that was involved in making this game played a video game ever. Like, a single one. More advanced than Pong. I know it seems kind of toxic that I'm just calling into question, like, a uh, game dev skills, even though I'm not a game dev myself. But come on, from a consumer point of view, there has to be limits. I 
get in, it's probably gonna be a bubble showing up there. like a, uh, a long play of this on YouTube, and for some reason it showed that it was like over two, just over two hours. Like, unless you memorize this game, to the point you don't even remember your own name, how the hell do you beat this game in two hours? My date. At this point, you should be getting married. After all this shit. Look out, dream girl, here I come. Ben, you're late. Blah 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 That's a girl for me. I'm out of here. He went through all that trouble for a date, and all of a sudden he's just meeting another one. The end. And now his car is gone. And then he just goes. Wow, I'm surprised they actually put the credits in the game. You'd think they want to keep themselves anonymous. Disappointed! Well, that was a game. Frustrated into the goddamn word for it! Obviously, this is not bullshit. a good one, but it was. A game? Ass! Alright, well, that's gonna be it for the stream. Thank you all so much for tuning in. Um, let's see. Who's uh, streaming tonight? Well. Uh, Cows has shown up to my streams in the past. He's actually doing his first ever playthrough of Pokemon Y, so why don't we go show him some love? And then tomorrow, we get back to Soldiers. 
think we might be able to finish the uh, water laboratory next. Until then, take it easy.